It was a beautiful April morning. I was parked on the side of a country road, sitting on the tailgate of my hatchback painting, looking like a stranded motorist. A passing pickup slowed, crept past me, and then reversed to come back and see if I needed help. This happens a lot near Snow Hill because everyone's really friendly. The young driver leaned out the window, but he interrupted his own question. His eyes lit up with recognition, and he said to me, Oh! You're just coloring! <laughs> yep, that's exactly right. Paint Snow Hill is an annual, non-juried, plain air painting event and exhibition in the heart of Maryland's Eastern Shore. During the third week of April, rain or shine, 70 artists haul their painting gear around town and into the countryside for three days of outdoor painting. The challenge of making art outdoors is that the scene in front of you changes constantly throughout the day. Sometimes those changes are subtle shifts in the shadows while you're working. And sometimes they are a surprise wind gust that sends your canvas flying. You have to be ready for anything. Like some kind of migratory animal, I've been repeating this ritual for over a decade now. But that first year I came painting in Snow Hill, I had never painted the landscape before. I thought the subject matter was probably dull. I had certainly never worked outdoors from direct observation, and what an education I received. It was a little like going to a rodeo for the first time and deciding to commit myself to bull riding. When the stars align properly and plein air painting is going right, it's the most exhilarating eight seconds you've ever seen, but at least half the time you get bucked off. Paint Snow Hill has grown me up as an artist. I have become stubbornly committed to painting the landscape. Each year I meet all of these wonderful artists who have dedicated years of their life to capturing the personality quirks of the landscape. They are so inspiring. I want to have that intimate understanding of place. Our lives are full of instant everything. Plain air painting forces me to slow down and carefully notice what is around me. The drifting clouds, the new leaves opening, the music of crickets, and even the delicate smell of chicken manure on the breeze. And then I get to share that experience with you at the wet paint show and sale at the end of the event. It's held in the old firehouse on Green Street, a block away from Bishop Stock Gallery. If you have ever felt intimidated about walking into a gallery or an art show, this event is about as welcoming as it gets. Each year, Ann Coates and her many helpers come together to produce a relaxed evening of good friends, good music and good wine, and of course, good art. It is a terrific opportunity for collectors to meet the artists and hear the stories behind the paintings firsthand. Now I know everyone is different, but when I purchase a painting, it's number one, because I love the artwork, and number two, because I feel a strong personal connection to the artist and their story. So come on, slow down with us. I'd love to see you. Unless you're an artist thinking of applying for Paint Snow Hill next year. It's terrible. You'll hate it. Try Easton. <laughs>